Hello everyone, welcome to Godot channel. In today's tutorial, we are going to learn about signals in Godot engine. I used 3.5 version and it's a stable version. So first of all, we need to create a new project. Let us give the name of signals, for example. Feel free to name it whatever you want. For the root scene, I'm going to use a node 2D scene and add a chart to it, also a node 2D. You can use whatever node you want, just for this example, I'm going to use a node 2D. Let us rename it to main and child, then save. We need to attach a script for the child node. And here is where we are going to declare the signal. So, signal, let us give the name of Godo signal. And in the process function, we need to emit that signal. So, func process. I'm going to set a condition for when to emit that signal. So, if input dot is action pressed I'm gonna use the UI select which means the spacebar button so if we press the spacebar button we emit that signal so signal emit signal and the name of our signal called signal so this is it for the child node let's go back to the main node and also attach a script to it so first of all we need to call the child node so already var child dollar sign child and uh, the dollar sign mean here get node so we can type get node and the name of the uh, the node or we can simply type dollar sign and the name of the node which is more simpler in the ready function we are going to connect that signal so child connect uh, the name of the signal which is codo signal we need to connect it to this node so save and call function so here we need to create function uh, let us name it let us give the name of uh, testing signal and we keep things simple so every time we emit uh, that signal we are going to print a message so print signal is working so every time we press the spacebar a message will appear to us and let us go back here and type the name of the method or the function so it's testing signal let us try it select current as you can see we have nothing here no message at all so we are going to press the space button so as you can see when I press the space button a message appeared here telling us that the signal is working and every time I press the space button a signal will appear to us that means that the signal is working correctly so this is it for today I hope you enjoyed the video see you in the next one